I'm Everett. And I'm Josie. And welcome to The, the Rant. Rant. So this Sunday was Josie's birthday. And what did we do? We went roller skating for the first time ever. That was the first time you went roller skating? Yeah, it's an American thing. But you've gone rollerblading. Okay, I've done inline skating like a bunch of times. But I've never had those old school American roller skates where the four wheels are like weirdly next to each other. Wait, you don't have quads in Germany? No. Really? Yeah, I was always really jealous of Britney Spears and the Skechers commercial because she had these really cool ones and you could not buy them in Germany. So this has been like a dream of mine forever. They don't have roller rinks. No. They have ice skating rinks. Yes, we have ice skating rinks. Some are permanent, but most of them just show up around December. Because Germany is cold. Yes. Ever go to a roller rink and your wife suddenly decides to pull off tricks for the first time? Ever? Now, we're gonna talk about soccer. That's right! It's Women's World Cup, baby! And the United States is here to defend their title! Unless Germany beats them and we get our third title. We already have our third title, because we're America! We're the best at soccer! Women's soccer! There's a ton of competition, not just Germany, but also Japan, and Brazil, and England, and France, which is where the World Cup takes place, which is gonna be awesome. Germany has two titles. Uh, Japan has one, Norway has one, and the United States have three. So we're the best, just saying. We have four men's titles and two women's titles, and that gives us a total of six titles more than any country in the world. That men's soccer, men, men's soccer doesn't count. Keep it in Germany or this time France. Hey, good job, France. Good job, France. I can't do the clubs. There's so many clubs. If someone asked me, hey, who's your favorite club? I'd be like, uh, Real Madrid? Her team is Red Bull Leipzig. Leipzig for the win. That's right, because they got wings. Hashtag Red Bull. Give us money. All Americans think that soccer is boring because they're stupid. They do not have the attention span to actually watch an entertaining sport for 45 minutes. They're all like, oh, we need commercials every 10 seconds and cheerleaders. When soccer, you can just enjoy the quality of the game. So for the longest time, soccer really meant nothing to America. Until this. Chastain will take it. Since then, it's all about women's soccer. Except, of course, it's still really not. Because women do not get paid enough for soccer. They have terrible, like, conditions for playing and training. For example, they play the World Cup on artificial turf. It hurts like hell when you slide on it. And everybody knows you can't have a soccer game unless you're sliding. I mean, what are you even scoring a goal for if you're not gonna slide? Oh, except if you can do this. So you saw that U.S. women's team. I better start seeing flips this year. Because there are still issues with the FIFA organization. I mean, FIFA is always under fire. And the corruption isn't going to end ever. How does FIFA's corruption affect women's soccer? Uh, poorly. It's their fault that the pay isn't that great, that the advertisement isn't that great. It's the biggest event in women's soccer ever. It only takes place every four years. But they scheduled the final to be on the same day as the Copa America, which is just a regional tournament. Copa America is strictly South American. And it takes place every year. They have a hundred chances of winning that nonsense. But becoming a world champion, you can only do that every four years. Beer in the morning. Woohoo! Well, I think that's actually the best thing about watching soccer in America is that most of your games are really early in the morning. In Germany, it just kind of sucks because you have like the whole day of work and sometimes you have to stay up really late because who knows how long the game is. If your team wins, you're too excited, you have to party, you can't go to sleep or your team loses, you're just really like sad before going to bed. Your arm's okay? Oh. Really quick shout out to the other cup, the one with clubs. Oh, the Champions League one second. Sign up. Liverpool won, congratulations. Good job, Tottenheim. We were rooting for you. 
And congrats to England for being the only country that was good this year. But also uh, congratulations to the coach of Liverpool, who is German. So really Germany wins. Finally, we're going to do predictions for the World Cup this year. Which two teams do you think are going to be in the final and how is it going to end? For obvious reasons, that is going to be the United States versus Germany. And the United States will win. I'm hoping for a 7-1 to one win. Okay, well, I don't think anybody is going to Germany Brazil this thing. I think Germany and the US will be in the final. And it's going to be a two to one. Nah, 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 nah. If you like this episode and you want to watch more, don't forget to subscribe so you can know every time that a new rant comes up. You want to watch more rant videos? You can click right here. And if you want to watch anything else on our channel, you can just click right here. And don't forget our social media. Boop, 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 boop. If you have anything that we got wrong or you disagree with, or if you have anything else that you want us to rant about, just put it in the comment section down below. We'd love to hear from you. Yeah, and we'll talk about it and say why you're wrong. You're definitely wrong.